We have all seen how 2023 has been a great year for farming games, and while 2024 has a lot of promising farms and titles releasing, if you're like me who kinda needs a little breather from all of that, then here are some cozy games with little to no farming that you definitely have got to check out. So let's go! Number 1. Neko Odyssey If you love pets, and I mean like really love them, then this one's for you! Neko Odyssey is a cute casual adventure game where we take pictures of funny pixel cats in a rural Japanese town. We get to post our cat pictures in social media, earn likes from NPC netizens, and get random tips on cat locations. So yep, we basically gotta stalk all of the pixel cats. Stalking and cats? Those are my two favorite things ever. That's why I'm definitely playing and covering this game when it's out. Neko Odyssey is developed by Secret Character and it's fun to be released sometime in 2024. Number 2. Cat Quest 3 I'm sorry, not really, but here's another cat game that you have got to see. But don't worry, not all games on this list are about cats, I think. Anyways, if you like 2.5D action RPGs, then this one is perfect for you. Get it? Perfect! Ha! <laughs> I am killing it! But yeah, all three games follow the story of cat and dragons except for Cat Quest 2 where you can play in co-op or remote play as a cat or dog hero. For this third game though, we'll be focusing on our cat friend once again but with more high seas adventure. Yep, cat pirates! You heard me! We'll get to sail the seas, steal treasures, and kick some butts! The Cat Quest series is one of my favorite cat games ever, so I highly recommend checking out Cat Quest 1 and 2 and wish this thing the third game to get updated for its 2024 release. Number 3. Fruit Bus This one is not a cat game, but some of the NPCs are cats. Fruit Bus is a cozy cooking and exploration game where we get to own a food truck. We get to forage fresh ingredients, cook dishes, see crazy cute reactions from a bunch of funny customers, and customize our trucks. Fruit Bus is developed by Krillbit Studios and it's planned to be released sometime in 2024. Number 4. Dungeon Inn This is a unique turn-based puzzle game about running an inn for two factions that hate each other. We gotta do our best not to get caught by the guilds so that they wouldn't kill us. So yeah, whenever we get caught, we can just have them kill each other. Super fun! Now that I think about it, it's not entirely wholesome but it has cats. And they're cute. And really, this game is a fresh take on turn-based and management games. There's a lot of gimmicks that we can do to distract clients, speed up processes, make lots of money, and make guilds kill each other. Have I mentioned that we can make them kill each other? Well, if you are intrigued, then lucky for you because Dungeon Inn has a demo right now on their Steam page for you to try. Number 5. Baladins Here's another turn-based tabletop style game that you must try. In Baladins, we get to choose our own adventure and lead a funny journey in a fantasy world where we got skills and stats that could help us progress through the story. There's a number of characters for us to choose from, each with unique expertise. Baladins can also be played by up to 4 people so it's perfect to play with friends or family. If you think that this is your sort of game, then head over to their Steam page and check out their free demo. Number 6. World's Worst Handyman Next up, we have a funny and chaotic adventure game where we play as an adorable and kind-hearted but also sorta of dumb and unlucky character. We get to do a bunch of handyman tasks, avoid angry clients, do some stealthy stuff, fail a lot, all for the sake of saving an animal shelter. World's Worst Handyman is developed by Baby Lumberjack and it's planned to be released sometime in 2024. Demo is also up on Steam if you wanna check out what this game has to offer. Number 7. Little Sim World If The Sims had like an adorable child, then it would be Little Sim World. A life sim where we get to live a life that we probably can't have in real life, like those other life sims. We can make a cute character, cook food for them, design our house, get a job, and do a bunch of stuff in this small virtual world. This game is developed by Blue Gravity Studios and it's planned to be released in quarter 1, 2024. Number 8. Promenade do you love adorable platformer games or just games that lets you think outside of the box and be all creative? Well then, Promenade has got you. It's a 2D platformer adventure game where we play as a small child. Like, literally small. We get to solve puzzles, wander across dungeons, defeat bosses, and play a bunch of unique minigames. Promenade is developed by Holy Cat and it's releasing on February 24, 2024. 
A free demo is also up on Steam if you wanna check it out. Number 9. Magical Galaxy I have been watching this game for a while now, and I'm so happy that it's finally releasing in 2024. Magical Delicacy is a pixel art platformer where we play as a witch, and we get to cook literally magical food. We also get to explore town, deliver our awesome food to the NPCs, and discover a bunch of secrets in this little witchy world. Number 10. Love Ghosty Shipping characters is one of my favorite hobbies, especially for anime characters. So I'm really happy that I get to do it in Love Ghosty, a matchmaking game where we can sort of force characters to fall in love. And we do it as a ghost. We can ship anyone with anyone and help their love life bloom by sending gifts on someone's behalf. We can also set them up on dates. And you know, if I ever do become a ghost, I would really do the same. You know, just mess with other people's lives and make them fall in love or something. A demo for Love Ghosty is also available on Steam. Number 11, Chia. And of course, the award-winning Chia is on the list. This is an open-world adventure set in a breathtaking archipelago matched with physics-driven sandbox. We get to climb, glide, swim, sail, engage in combat, and play a ukulele in this beautiful game. It's planned to be released in March 2024. Number 12, Europa. Another breathtaking game on this list is Europa, the Ghibli-inspired game about an android named Z who sets out to Jupiter's shadow in search for answers about the story of the last human alive. Like Chia, we get to glide and explore amazing landscapes, and if you're curious about how beautiful I'm talking about here, then you're in luck because Europa's demo is still up on their Steam page right now. This game is developed by Helder Pinto and Novadas Entertainment, and it's planned to be released on April 17, 2024. Number 13, On Your Tail. Now let's talk about Cozy Mysteries. On Your Tail is a detective game with life sim elements. We play as Diana and get to visit a secluded Italian village, uncover layers of mysteries, investigate and interrogate, build relationships, and kind of do some less detective work like cooking, fishing, playing games, and even stargazing. It's up to us to decide how we want to spend the summer vacation as Diana. Number 14, Duck Detective The Secret Salami Another cozy mystery game coming in 2024 is Duck Detective, but this one is a lot less serious than On Your Tail. From the creators of Kraken Academy, another funny pixel game, Happy Broccoli Games brings us a 2.5D cute detective game where we play as a duck detective. We get to use our powers of deduction to inspect evidence and find out who the heck is stealing lunch. Duck Detective is planned to be released sometime in 2024. Number 15. Bloomtown A Different Story Last but definitely not the least, one of my most anticipated games of 2024, the not-so-cozy and not-so-wholesome game called Bloomtown. Sure, it looks cute, but it's a lot like Stranger Things except with less romance. In this game, we play as a smart child named Emily who is spending her summer break in a rural and mysterious town set in a 1960s Americana world. And for some reason, demons have been kidnapping children and it's up to us to save the day. Along with our brother, new friend, and a cute bubble, we get to banish, kidnap, and fuse demons in a turn-based and creature collection JRPG style. Bloomtown recently did a close alpha playtest, and while I'm not really allowed to say anything about it, just know that the game looks and plays really well. Some of the stuff still needs a couple of tweaks, but all in all, I am just super excited to play the finished version of this game. Bloomtown is set to be released in quarter 2, 2024. And that's about it for our non-farming cozy games of 2024. Even though one or two of them are not really cozy, but hey, which one caught your attention? Let me know in the comments. Also shout out to our friends Panda, Sludgy, Tiana, Nenny, and Mr. G for your amazing holiday gifts. I really appreciate you all so much. Really love you guys. And to our channel members, thank you as always too for your kind support. I hope everyone had a great holiday celebration and here's to an amazing new year. Have a happy, happy new year, my dear humans. Bye-bye.